So yesterday I, was, I started painting the, uh, what I call the homage to the, the pass. And um, I finished up these uh, today. And there's another, probably another, uh, just over a third more left um, waiting to dry. And I've got to put the finishing uh, colours on those. But you can see, um, what I did was to take the themes that had emerged from interaction with the, with the Donegal Pass, the people, the community in the Donegal Pass, and also the themes that had emerged from the uh, unstructured interviews, the biographical interviews which I, I conducted. And then really to take those themes and, and kind of abstract them another layer, and also then introduce other elements. Um, and really the, the greatest single idea that I'm playing with here is this, 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 this idea of layers, that the, you know, that a community doesn't exist as one kind of finite layer, which you see on the surface is often not representative of the, the greater community at all. And a lot of these, they're playing with different elements. There's some obvious symbols in them um, and some text in some of them. And then a lot of them, the text has got buried and covered over and is built upon layers upon layers upon layers. And um, this is really what I've ended up with. So these are, I'm going to tie the threads on these uh, tomorrow, I think. And then I'm going to try to get them on the wall as soon as possible. The only problem is I have a workshop now on um, Tuesday. Uh, which means that the wall's going to fill up slightly, so I've kind of missed the window a little bit in terms of getting these on as an interim uh, measure, although I guess the workshop is probably only going to be about eight to ten people. Um, but still, you know, it just it took a lot longer than, than, I, than I imagined it was going to take. And, um, you know, there are some of these ones here, They're really, really interesting images. And um, I'm just kind of curious to see how they are received once they're on the wall and to see if anything, what kind of reaction it provokes. Uh, because these are likely to get stolen, trashed or, and eventually burnt, I guess, what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to photograph these and I thought that in the booklet that I'm putting in, in the grant proposal for, that I would actually include these photographs in the back of the booklet as a kind of response to um, the, the pass, if you like. So that's my, my plan at the moment, is to include uh, these images as well as, as the ones that the pass actually generated. So there'll be a kind of two-part section, there'll be the kind of the past speaking, if you like, and then there'll be my my artistic response uh, to the past. Um, so that's what my plan is at the moment. So I've got about another 30 more just drying. And once they've dried, then um, I can get those finished up and get the threads tied and then get them on the wall.